Yo, what's up, everybody? <clears throat> Yo, I'm really sick right now, and I wasn't gonna put out a video for you guys, but uh, I really needed to. All right, because I can't stop this grind. You guys been showing love and all this, so originally I wanted to do a, do a rant about this patch, but you know what? I'm just gonna analyze this patch. I'm gonna tell you exactly how I feel, exactly what you should look for. But let's get to it. So first off, before this video starts, actually, uh. I'm gonna hear people like, oh, you're never happy about a patch, whatever. Of course I'm not. I'm never gonna be happy about a patch because this is all trash, honestly. But anyways, let me completely analyze this patch. It's to the point where six foot seven point guards are getting green lights on the threes. They make in more shots than six foot three players or below are. It's kind of annoying because you know how six foot seven people are fucking taller and get clamps, you know what I mean? So it's fucking irritating. But anyways, that's not even that's not even the point. If you don't contest it and the person is not in a fadeaway animation and they're like six foot three or something, it's going in. Like it's going in. Like no matter what. I mean, the patch did improve. It didn't. It didn't make the la last patch look a lot better. Uh. Actually, really good job to Ronnie. They needed to patch that bullshit because it was so terrible. But anyways, that this is just to the point where it's irritating because now it's like, okay, I was playing a couple games earlier, all right, and uh, what happened was I clamped this dude on three point line, and now this dude would run right into the mid range. It was like he dribbled the entire twenty seconds. 20 seconds he dribbled, ran into the mid-ranges, got a mid-range, green light. Like, in patch 3, or patch, I don't know, I think patch 2 is still what's happening. But patch 3, I think I like the most. Because when you were getting clamped like that, you couldn't go to the mid-range and just pull it. You would get, like, a red light on it. But now it's to the point where they fixed that, and now you can easily get a green light no matter what. Another area situation was where a dude ran into the paint, ran out to the 3-point line, and then made the shot in the corner. Like, yo... Like, that shit is so fucking weak. You know what I mean? Like, they're not even hitting a dribble move at this point. It's just, like, you're just running and trying to get an open three like that. But it's just... It's something that I need to bring up because that's just terrible. Like, boy, like, when you're not even dribbling to get open, you're just running. And if you get clamped, you just run to the mid-range and you get an easy green light. Like, that shit is just so weak to me. In my eyes, I think that's fucking retarded. But besides that... Besides that... I honestly do think this is going to be the last patch that 2K will give us. And it's somewhat like patch 4 for 2K15, if you never noticed that. You know what I'm saying? Like, because you're making... This is the patch where you're making the, mo the most green lights. Six foot seven players are getting green lights. All dribbles and shit. This is one of those patches. You know what I mean? You get a clamp. You go to the mid-range. Pull a nice, easy mid-range. Get that green light. Easy. You know, so... This is definitely something similar. This is like a flashback to like patch four for 2K15, and I think Clay Clay LG he called it because I remember some somebody some a lot of people in OG were calling this that they were gonna make patch four again, you know. And at one point it was like, yeah, sure, that would have been a good idea and with the defense that was on this game in patch four. It would have been awesome. Yeah, it's uh, it's um, it's I mean, it's a lot better. You know, because patch 5, nobody was hitting shit. You can be open, you miss it. But you can be contested, you're making it. They've, this patch, they made it that if you get contested, like, on a fadeaway or some shit, you're definitely not making that. You're definitely not making that. If when I do 1v1s and somebody makes a fadeaway, the minute the next possession happens and the next person takes a bad shot like that, they goes in. I, and that's not a coincidence. I really don't think so. Anyways, hopefully you guys have an idea of what i think about this patch and hopefully you guys can give me your idea anyways just hit that like comment and subscribe please give me your thoughts in the description of what you think about this patch if i'm just bitching too much or something because I, this is just how i feel it's not the same amount of people that play this game anymore on this patch that's just how i'm trying to get my feelings out on some shit but anyways make sure you hit that like comment and subscribe and i'm out y'all Yo, just to let you guys know, if you want to buy MT, just go to the description. There will be a link to NBA MT Nana. Use my name, Taz, for a discount.